Hi, my name is Sirish Bachu and I am uh, here at Embitel responsible for the product engineering solutions uh, which comprises of the automotive and IoT for mobility verticals. Uh, prior to this, I was working as a managing director for a company, Danla Technologies India Limited, which was into telematics and connected vehicle solutions plus automotive electronics for the automotive OEMs based out of India. And before that, I had a brief stint with Aether Energy, which is into electric two wheelers and Mahindra and Mahindra working on the mobility solutions and uh, with Bosch in India for a very long time. Um, I have been uh, observing Embitel right since uh, it was founded uh, by Sharad and I am really happy the way Embitel has grown in this uh, space where uh, it has established itself as a niche player for providing solutions in the automotive and the IoT segment and also the way the company has grown in terms of the people, in terms of the culture, in terms of values and also focus on the technology in terms of creating a lot of IP uh, around the automotive solutions, what uh, Embitel does. So I, I would say that's really exciting the way it has uh, grown up. And uh, as we look at the automotive industry into the future, there's, uh, uh, things are changing a lot and software is going to play a much bigger role in the whole scheme of things. And this is where I see the role of Embitel being uh, much more critical and uh, being as an enabler for the software development for the entire automotive customers across the globe. So uh, I see a great potential that uh, working with Embitel, we can reach out to many more automotive players uh, and provide our solutions and take it to the next level. And that's my main motivation to join Embitel. Well, uh, as I mentioned earlier, the entire automotive industry is undergoing a sea of change where a lot more domination of software is going to come. And uh, with that, the way uh, our teams are positioned in Embitel uh, in this area, uh, there's a lot of potential to work in the innovative solutions for the automotive industry across the globe. So here uh, uh, we look at our solutions going into all the connected vehicles, all the electric vehicles and uh, also looking at the new age uh, autonomous vehicles and the ADAS developments and so on. So there's a huge potential what we can really uh, grow our solutions and offer to the OEMs across the globe. And uh, my vision would be to taking uh, where we stand today in terms of the journey we have covered so far of creating a lot of IPs and a lot of solutions for different uh, OEMs to the next orbit where we can scale up and scaling up uh, without any compromise on the quality. So one of the core fundamentals is to maintain the quality and uh, scale up our uh, solutions to reach across the globe. Well, uh, looking ahead, there are three cornerstones, um, primarily the people, the process and the technology front. And on the people front, I believe that uh, we are going to scale up uh, in the coming months and coming years to uh, meet the demand what is there in the industry. So towards that, we'll have a fine mix of uh, the experienced industry veterans as well as the millennials who can bring in fresh ideas and a vibrant work culture here. Uh, and together create a culture of innovation. Uh, on the process front, uh, we're already uh, having uh, on the CMMI and then the TSACs uh, a lot of certifications, but then we'll also have to upgrade ourselves to match to the industry demands. So uh, also when I say upgrading, we need to also upgrade ourselves in terms of uh, enhancing our test uh, frameworks, uh, bringing in more and more automations, going much more deeper into simulations or model-based development, or basically uh, in a nutshell, contributing to the overall software-defined vehicle, which is going to be the future in the automotive industry. On the technology front, there are multiple dimensions to the areas what we work on. And uh, if I talk primarily about the automotive space and the software uh, areas which are there, uh, we will be going much more deeper in the already incumbent areas of uh, embedded uh, solutions, whether you talk of AutoSAR or functional safety. Uh, these are the areas we would like to go much more deeper. 
uh, and also make sure that uh, our value proposition is not only coming just as a service model but as a complete solution model so that the end customers can take an integrate ready of the shelf solutions which are there from our side uh, when i talk of the new technologies which are coming in, in terms of the adas autonomous driving and so on we naturally have to upskill ourselves where we are, will be looking at the uh, top industry talent uh, and acquiring them and then building teams around that uh, and looking at the other areas in terms of the newer generation communication technologies, for example, 5G or the Bluetooth or the networking and so on, uh, we are looking at uh, uh, partnering with perhaps the industry leaders in that to work along with them, learn with them and then establish core competencies in those areas as well for ourselves. So this will be in a nutshell a very broad generic overview, but then uh, there's much more depth in what uh, we have to achieve going into the future.